a charge q is distributed uniformly within the material of a hollow sphere of inner and outer radii r1 and r2 find the electric field at a point p at a distance of x away from the center where x varies from r1 and r2 draw a rough graph showing the electric field as a function of x for x varies from 0 to r2 fine now first of all i had to calculate the electric field fine when we know that flux is given by e dot ds is equal to q and close by epsilon naught now this is just the concept for solving whole question let's say that when x varies from 0 to r1 fine so the e dot ds will be equal to q enclosed q enclosed of course there is no charge between 0 to r1 distance so q enclosed is 0 and so the electric field let's say e1 is 0 fine now when x varies from r1 to r2 so I can write according to Gauss law E dot now let's say I assume a sphere over here which is at a distance x from the center right so the area will be 4 pi x square and q in that is the charge enclosed only by this much area when this much of volume I am taking into consideration so I had to calculate the charge that is present in this much volume so to calculate this charge let's say rho that is the charge density volume charge density that will be given by q total in the total volume that is the hollow sphere divided by total volume that is 4 by 3 pi r2 cube minus r1 cube fine this is my surface charge this is my volume charge density now clearly I do have a volume charge density so I can calculate the charge enclosed in this much surface that is the surface charge density into volume of this much part that will be equal to 4 by 3 pi x cube minus r1 cube alright so I do have a q in now just substitute the value I have pi x cube minus r1 cube it is e dot 4 pi x square alright and uh, just substitute the value of rho with this so I get q to 4 by 3 pi r2 cube minus r1 cube into 4 by 3 pi x cube minus r1 cube so 4 by 3 pi and 4 by 3 pi is cancelled this 4 pi comes down over here so e comes out to be q into x cube minus r1 cube divided by 4 pi x square r2 cube minus r1 cube that is my answer for the electric field when the distance is between r1 and r2 now let's say if distance is between r2 to 2 times of r2 then clearly if I apply e is equal to 4 pi x square let's say there is a sphere like this which is at a distance of x so it will be 4 pi x square is equal to net charge enclosed that will be equal to q because the total charge enclosed in the whole hollow sphere is q by epsilon naught so electric field comes out to be q by 4 pi epsilon naught x square fine so I can easily draw the graph now the electric field for the first distance this is x this is electric field so the electric field when x varies from 0 to r1 is 0 so it will be like this fine and then suddenly it gains up to a value goes like this and goes like this and this is the answer